A while back, something terrible happened in our solar system. I know. I know you don't like me to bring it up. What's that? Hold on a second. Was there a meteor in the sky recently above yes. England? Is that a real thing that happened? Yes. Did anybody see it? Space junk. It was unknown. It was space junk? That's what they called that. Yeah. Was it like a like a rock? It was so, so funny. <laughs> I'm very smart about science. <laughs> I mean, was it was it from outer space or was it like a piece of a spaceship or something? Yeah, it was from outer space. Inner space, <laughs> inner space, outer space. The debate rages on. Did they recover any pieces of it? No. You know what? I'll just Google it later. This is not an official <laughs> It's like a living living Wikipedia, just as unreliable. <laughs> Citation needed, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> anyway, that is not the terrible thing to which I'm referring. Uh, I'm speaking, of course, about the demotion of Pluto. From planet... Oh, okay. Scientists decided that they were going to do it, so it's okay. It's science. Yeah, science is stupid. Science is stupid, and all scientists should be burned in a fire. For messing with what we know is true. <laughs> with their facts, <laughs> their experiments, their math. Come on. We know what the truth is in our guts and our stomachs, where our souls are. <laughs> it's not a real plan. Oh, okay. Oh, a scientist. <laughs> The thing is, it's not a real planet anymore. It was a real planet when we called it a real planet. Yeah, okay, all right. I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to incite such uh, emotion in all of you. I'm just trying to introduce the song in an amusing way. I don't want to start a fight. But the thing is, when, when Pluto was demoted from planet status to dwarf planet status, uh, which really, to not be offensive, they should say little person planet status, and uh, uh, the Pluto's. <laughs> Somebody told a joke that was very funny. I didn't hear. Uh, Pluto has a moon called Charon, and um, they are relatively similar in size. They they uh, actually revolve around uh, each other. The center of their orbits is between them, and they also they they face one another the whole time. I mean, if you can tell which is the face and which is the butt. You know. uh, and it's a very romantic idea. Um, to someone who is trying to write a song and can't think of anything else. And uh, so this is, this is a song that Charon uh, wrote and uh, sang for Pluto in space. And Pluto could not hear because there's the vacuum. <laughs> that is the real tragedy. <laughs> this is called I'm Your Moon.
very much. Ladies and gentlemen, Tom Storm. Audience, uh, audience was starting to divide into factions. <laughs> yeah, I was starting to feel the science riot in my very own bones. <laughs> Your very own bones? Yes, my, my very own bones were my soul was Science honest. riot is my Thomas Doldy cover. <laughs> <laughs> really? My thought that was good. My, thought, oh. my time has passed. They're fickle. 